to be here in the country for the last 20 years. Uh, you know, to really break it down uh, into very simple parts, we've uh, actually split that into into three parts. The first one, the first phase was about you know building the brand. The second thing is about growing it, and then it's about acceleration. So, uh, you know, when we when we got into the country 20 years back, apart from from a few people who knew about what you know, McDonald's is and what it stands for, etc. So after the initial euphoria was done of you know miles long of queue to get inside and access that and all that, it, it clearly required uh, you know the, the next level uh, to to you know, move forward. And uh, you know that's when you know we realized that the barrier actually to do trial uh, for, for McDonald's was uh, you know people felt that you know okay anything that's behind a glass and that's air conditioned would be perceived to be an expensive place uh, and that was the barrier that we needed to break uh, so we actually you know, hit that insight and uh, even till to till date you know, when you talk to people who are the most recalled advertising of McDonald's uh, you know, people very fondly speak about uh, you know stage fright uh, and that commotion really really resonated uh, you know, very well with consumers and it it opened the you know gates to a whole lot of people who had that barrier to, to uh, you know walking into McDonald's. Uh, you know once once we were done with that and we, as we started you know getting into the into the growth phase of it, uh, you know we needed to uh, start appealing with uh, you know more localization of flavor and finally you know if you have to explore any category you know, in a country like India, it has to be based on, on value. Uh, and that's when you know uh, came in came in. Uh, you know the Mekalu Tiki, which uh, you know just got people running in through, through the doors of, of McDonald's, and it pretty much almost you know founded the the category of burgers uh, in the in the country. Uh, and post that, now we are actually you know in a fairly exciting phase of, of our journey because we are now pushing ourselves into you know adding more uh, apart from adding more stores, we are adding uh, more conveniences to the to the brand. We are adding uh, coffee. Uh, we are adding. Uh, drive-throughs, we're adding highway stores, uh, just making ourselves more and more ubiquitous uh, and, and ensuring that uh, you know people can access us from, from any conceivable uh, angle that you may want to access McDonald's with. It's not just only about you know investment. Of course, investment is uh, investment is important uh, for which we have an outlay, and that will be in the range of about 700 to 750 crores, where we aspire to go from the current 245 uh, restaurants to about 500 odd restaurants. Uh, but like I was I was mentioning, uh, you know, what's important for us is uh, you know that we are offering conveniences, value, and menu uh, to our to our uh, to, to the people we serve. And what I mean by that is, uh, you know, we need, we want to be relevant across day parts. So you know, we are the only, only uh, player right now who is uh, only brand that is operating really in in, in a space like breakfast. Uh, so breakfast is a, is a is a unique dimension that we want to see uh, grow uh, more than where we are actually. Uh, you know, coffee as a, as a culture is picking up, and therefore, uh, you know, the proliferation in mug cafes. In a, in a city like Mumbai, we have about 45. Uh, Cafes and then overall we are at about 90 or more cafes. Uh, deliveries as a, as a platform is clearly gaining you know natural tailwind in the, in the category and we are expanding uh, in that space. Uh, and uh, and there is a whole load of other things like you know drive-throughs and, and other conveniences uh, which will you know get people to access us more often.